Today we are going to show you the difference between a presser and a power presser, how to maximize your opportunity at the table, and demonstrate very clearly how some of you are leaving a lot of money left to be won. Here's what we're going to do. First, the pressing. And pressing is doubling of the bet. So here we have a $6.08. It's going to pay 7 to double it. It's going to go to 12. 6 goes to 12, double. Now a power presser, you're going to go use all the money or add money to go to the next possible unit, the highest possible unit that you can. Now some people, they confuse this with meaning it goes to like a certain, like the third unit or the fourth unit. It does not. It really depends on the bet how many units it goes up. So here we have six and seven, which is 13. So in this case, you'd have to throw in five dollars to go to 18. And so essentially, that's the third unit. But the next time around, it pays 21. And we're going to throw in $3, and, it's, and now we're going up four units. We're adding that to the 18, and now we're at 42. Okay, so you see how quickly this bet, when you're power pressing it, can move up and get to table limit. For our demonstration, we're going to pretend that each person has a $30 bankroll, and they're going to contribute $6 to set up the bet. All right, so each is going to contribute $6 to start an eight. Okay, $6.08, $6.08. This is going to be the press and collect. This is going to be power presser. And we're only going to do four eights. That's it. We're going to pretend that four eights roll. Now, not in a row, but inside of a roll before the person's seven out. So for our purposes, they came out in the point of four. And before there's a seven or even the number rolled, there, you're going to see four eights, which happens all the time, by the way. And we're going to show you the difference and what each person could have won and what one person didn't win. Okay. All right. So very first eight is going to roll, pay $7. This person's going to press. So they're going to press and collect. Okay. This person pays $7. They're going to contribute $5 and go to $18. The next roll. This person's going to collect $14. Congratulations. That same bet on 12 pays 14. This $18 eight pays 21. Our power presser is going to throw in $3 and go to 42. Okay. Hit number three. Again, presser. They're going to take $2 change and they're going to double the bet up. This person, however, is not going to collect. It's going to pay 50 for one. They're going to get a dollar change. And now they go all the way up to $90. On the fourth roll, this bet, $24 on the eight, it's going to pay $28. Congratulations, sir. Not a bad little take right there. This bet pays 105. And now let's compare and see who made out. All right. So first off, we have the press and collect person. And uh, wow, this looks like a lot of money. 75, 80, 85, $93. Congratulations, sir. $93 on four eights. Here we have $212, same four eights. So you see, if you've seen four eights at a table and you did something like this, you left some money on the table. You didn't create as much opportunity as you could have. And that's our very first very simple demonstration between the presser and power presser. And guess what? More videos. And more, more videos on Patreon. Thanks, guys. Bye.